we are going to have some really risky hub hub time. But now at this very moment I don't have time to do that because I am late for one other thing. But this package contains a mature female, a mature male, so we need to get him outside to see if he's all right, and then we will do one quick uh, time jump so I can continue with the video. Here is the guy, but I cannot really see very well. And if you can hear a lot of echo, at least more echo than you are used to, I cleaned up the dark then, so now it's a bit, a bit empty. So echo is a downside. Oh, I heard it right. We have some, some energy drinks, heck yeah, and some candy. First, let me, let me, no, I shouldn't, I will take, the, ooh, this is actually, check this out, Monster Espresso, <laughs> I don't drink coffee, but I will definitely try this out, <laughs> nice, so, what I wanted to say, what I need to do, I will take him outside, check if he is alright, put him in a enclosure for him, and then we will time jump where I will explain everything, okay, okay, this is the priority for now. Uh, I need a box, a box with a little bit of substrate because this guy, he doesn't have any digging on his mind. All that he thinks now is how to get some booty, <laughs> to get some action. All right, may I say that the package is really, really nice and the guy seems all right. Do you know which species this is? You should know it for sure. We have a girl. Let's see how bold he is. Hey, little guy, you can stretch your legs now. Yeah. There you go. He's actually really big, not really big, but bigger than the male that I had. And definitely a bit darker than my male was. Nice, this is Chromatopelma cyanopubescens male. And you see, this male is completely fine. The package was good, shipping was fast, and yeah, that's one happy tarantula. Now let's do one time jump and now I'm no longer in a rush so we can do this at normal pace. But actually the Rockstar and all the candy except this one, they're all thing of the past. And I left this one just to say that these are really, really amazingly good. And that's why I left this one just so I can remember to say that these are really nice. <laughs> and of course to eat it now. Mm. Also the Rockstar is thing of the past but I'm saving this so I can drink it with a friend of mine, so I can actually flex with it. Um, here is the note, but I know from who this package is. Magdalena from Germany sent me this, but let me just see what she wrote. Oof, I didn't know that. This male is actually her first tarantula, and when she asked me, when she told me that her Chromatopelma cyan opubescens male matured, and, and asked me if I want her to ship it over so I can pair it with my female, I warned her that this species is hard to breed and that there is high chance that the male will get eaten. It is like 49% that the male will be eaten, 49% that nothing will happen, and 2% that uh, breeding will be successful. And she was aware of that and fine with it, but she didn't tell me that it was, that this guy is her first tarantula, so mm, I really, really hope that he won't get eaten. Thank you for sending him and special thank you for the candy and for the drinks. Now let's bring the female and let's get this ball rolling. I'm already starting to feel a bit nervous because I know how this can end. She actually ate my, my male that I raised from Tiny Sling, so I know what she is capable of and I know that she is a man-eater, a proven man-eater. Hm. She unfortunately likes mature males a bit too much, a bit too much for my taste. So there is her, here is the male and yeah, let's get on with it. As always, I'm just going to open this enclosure and put it here near the entrance. And then we can gently just poke mail into her enclosure. Beep, beep. Hello, hello. Are you ready for the action guy? Huh? Uh, that, is, that is a straw. You need to turn around and go the other way. That is what I'm trying to do with this straw, man. Maybe I need two hands just to get him on. Let's go, let's go. There is no time to waste. Yes, there is the webbing, okay. Now let's... Oh, oh no, oh no. Wait, 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 dude. You know what you need to do? Drum first, drum, then she needs to drum. And only then you can start moving forward. Now we need to be aware that this is something that can go on for hours. They can actually stand like that for hours and do nothing. But I don't want to force anything. 
If nothing happens while we are waiting, I have a few more packages that we can open in the meantime. And hope oh, female is moving. Do you want to check who is on your front yard? Huh? We have a handsome guy here waiting for you. We just need you to be in the right mood for that. For some haba haba. <laughs> but you see that the guy is actually standing still like a stone, not moving a muscle. He probably already knows what's up. So, as I said, while we are waiting, I will put the camera here and we will grab the packages. But actually, check this out. Again with the noise, Despacito. Mm -hmm. What, you want to go out? What do you want, dude? You have roaches there, so I know that you are not hungry. You just want attention, I know. That guy. So, putting the camera and taking the fan mail. And I actually know what this is, because I recognize the sender. This is actually pretty dull. Anyhow, this should be a Mented Mania magazine. Yeah, it is. Is this a sticker? Yep, a sticker. Sweet. Actually, two issues of Mented Mania, and I think that I have two or three more. I'm not sure. Mike, thanks for sending me this. Next package. Despacito! Here, you are here now. Are you happy? Are you satisfied? Don't you look at me with the cheeky eyes. I will put you down and you can do stuff. But no noise, please. Is this a shirt? Oh, sweet. Sweet, but what is this? Bones and spiders. In spiders we trust. We do indeed. Oh, oh, oh. second, second, second. Female was drumming. I'm not sure if you could spot it here, but she was. That is a good sign. And check this pasito. He is in his exploration mode. <laughs> Climbing and stuff. But back to spiders. The guy is not drumming. I don't know why. He should usually be the first one to do that. So I hope that he will start. Anyhow, this shirt and sticker is from Alex. And he's actually owner of Bones and Spiders apparel brand. So thank you for sending me this. I'm going to wear the shirt for sure. As you see, I always wear shirts that I get from other people. And the last fan mail that I have here. Some fan art, you see? And is that actually a Hromatopelvatsia neopobestens? I think it is. <laughs> what a coincidence. <laughs> Indeed it is. This is from Julia and Roland. And she made this as Hromatopelvatsia neopobestens is actually her first tarantula. So what a coincidence. Crazy. Yeah, of course I'm going to put this on a, on a fan board. Let me just see. I see where I'll put it. Just a second. There, this is the spot for your art. Thank you for sending it. Oh, the mail is on a move. Yes, indeed. Okay, okay, but drumming, man. What did I told you about drumming? Oh, scary, 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 scary. But at least we know that she is aware that there is a mature male around and not a meal. Or for her, maybe both, because she already tasted the mature male. Despacito. Mm. Are you exploring the perimeter? <laughs> yeah, he's definitely looking around. But okay, I'm going to set up the camera once again and we will wait. Oh no! Moving again. Come on, can you make up your mind? Do you want to stand or move? I guess stand. So let's wait. Oh, that was like a shake stretch or something. I don't know. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, nothing, huh? Okay, I'm going to turn off this camera to conserve the, the storage space, but this camera will still be rolling. That way we won't miss any action. Oh, what happened here? I wasn't looking, I was doing stuff because they are so slow. But suddenly male is here. <laughs> and female is still on the same spot, but she was drumming. So actually this is maybe a good idea to go down here and then approach her from this angle. Maybe you're actually a really smart guy, I don't know. Or maybe he's just going wherever. Well, setting the camera once again and yeah. In this angle you will actually be able to see if the female is drumming.
Oh, 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 oh. Action. Oh, oh. They are drumming and everything. Yeah. This might go down. Unless she is luring him to... Uh, please. Please. Can we have this happen? Although this is not a good angle. You cannot really see the action very well. And we stopped. Maybe I can turn the enclosure a bit. Ah, uh, no, this side is all webbed up, I cannot see anything. This angle is unfortunately all that we got. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Seems like she's backing off, right? Yeah, she is backing off a bit. We can actually see her well from here. If anything goes down, of course. get the camera we're a nice angle if anything happens but from the previous attempts this doesn't mean anything when I was trying to breed this girl to my male they were doing things like that for hours just starting like it is going to happen then stop then start again then stop again then start again and stop again and as you can see the same thing is happening now but look at her color mmm damn boy my god did she try to i think that he escaped the the certain death unfortunately i wasn't here to look but judging how she was trying to bite this edge of the enclosure i think that it is lucky that this guy was fast holy moly but i'm actually glad that this is not over but over for now uh, because i need to go and eat even though for you this was a short attempt I was actually waiting for them for like hour and a half maybe now, maybe even two hours, so another time jump. I checked the footage and the thing that this guy did, it is basically a miracle. He was one badass motherfucker. And excuse my language, but he really was. The female basically had him. I don't understand how he managed to get away from that because you know, for the pairing, the male tries to leave the female with his front legs and then with his petty pops he is reaching under her so that means that the female is standing like this and he is like that he is just trying to reach her abdomen area where the, the spermathecas are so they are in this position and the female just needs to do this and the male is done and she basically did that she did this but somehow i don't know how he he was holding her and just bolted the hell out of there <laughs> you are the man and i'm certain that you was you had a pause blessing from the raft <laughs> he was so so brave and strong and capable and agile and everything should we try to handle him maybe let's see how that will go i also need to be brave just like he was because i never handled a chromatopelmatiana pubescence and looking at my female i think i think that i will never get a chance to do that but it looks like that he doesn't like the feel of human hand. Tarantulas usually don't like the feel of our hand. They know that it is something alive and not a stick or anything. But regardless, good job, man. I'm not sure, I'm not certain if he was successful, but he was under her for, I think, long enough, right? Also, after everything was done and I turned off the camera, I spotted the female doing something that females are doing after they, they were paired. He just, nope, 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 I don't want that. But anyhow, I recorded that. You can see that the female is like scratching her 
her spermatheca area and she was also webbing around and I think females do that after a successful pairing. So fingers crossed guys, let's hope that that was successful because I'm not sure if I want to throw this guy under the bus once again, even though he handled the situation amazingly. <laughs> this was definitely all for this video. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, thumbs it up and comment something. If you want to support this channel even more, there's a Patreon page. If you're new to this channel, make sure to subscribe. I upload every Monday and Friday. So see you guys soon. Bye!